Alright, day two, we're doing triple sevens in uh, Sand Hollow. We're excited about it, looking forward to it. The truck's been doing great. Had a little hiccup yesterday in the morning, but I think I just got a hydro on. But uh, other than that, we've been doing all the obstacles. You can kind of see our breath here a little bit. Uh, it's kind of cold, but uh, the sun comes out and uh, we get on the trail and it warms right up and you're shedding clothes. So we're looking forward to another great day. Can't wait to see what we can get into and what options we can take to challenge the truck a little bit. So here we go. Get a Back up before you start turning. You're all right, you're all right. James, you can actually come forward and then turn. Hug this.
Caleb. this rock. up Slipknot Gulch and uh, this was Hardtop Valley we just did and uh, man there's just not really a way to get around it uh, you're gonna end up hitting the, the fender on this side there's a cutout that goes underneath and uh, you just can't get your bumper up I tried about three times in a row to get the bumper up and have this wheel start to climb but uh, it just wouldn't climb and it kind of sucked because uh, when I started getting up, it hit the side of the fender immediately. So what do you do? We're here to wheel. We drove 20 some hours to get here. So this is what you got. My hood's crinkled in just a hair, but it's mainly the fender. So I've got to do some body work, but got a couple new scratches on it, some sand. So we're out here wheeling, having a great time. It is what it is. That's what you're here to do. I'm having an awesome time.
further. What? Should have came a little further up before you try to turn. There you go. You'll probably get it there. You go all the way back.
car. We just got off the trail. It's Friday here in San Hollow. Just got cleaned up. We're gonna have a little dinner tonight. What are we doing out here? So the first one, the last person to score points goes first. Playing a little cornhole. Had to get some of our real life. You supposed to stay behind us or? Just behind, the yeah, behind the front. So oh, okay. Cool. I was he's, that there. No, you're good. he's really a pro. He's just messing no, with you. No, I'm definitely not. Yeah. He's about to hustle everybody in here. Can we jack her up? Yep. What's going on under here? Wow. Got a bit. She's, she is bent. Is she? Can you see it? Holy cow. I couldn't see it. Really? Uh, you're good. Um, now I can see it. It's folded like this. <laughs> yeah. I can see her now. <laughs> I drop it on down. <laughs> Yeah, that, well, he, he got, we, we jacked it up last night, and now he's like, can you see it? I was like, get your light out. She's here. Like, oh, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's bent. Yeah, it's bent for sure. I could see it when we were going down the highway last night. Oh, could you? Oh, yeah. Well, I need to rotate more. That moved a lot. <laughs> Caleb, how's the weather this morning? Oh, it's a little cool. Uh, we're just out here giving James a hand, trying to help him where we can. He's got it handled. We uh, went over a rock yesterday at the maze, or I say we, Matt went over it first, moved it about three feet, boulder, as tall as his truck. That's the size of a Volkswagen. And then uh, I moved it a little bit more and I drove over it. And then James got high centered on it a little bit. And I think that's where he got a little bit of the damage where it touched his uh, drive shaft here, so. Well, it didn't touch it, it smacked it. It got it pretty good. It's got some good little spots on it. It's been ground down a little bit. But uh, the good news is, is since James kind of knows the way he wheels and I'm kind of the same way, we uh, always carry a spare with us. So right. we're gonna switch it out here. And usually it takes about mm, 15, 20 minutes. So we're getting it done. Usually. Usually. I don't always say it's going to take. I always say usually because there's always that unknown. Welcome to the final day of Winter 4x4 Jamboree. It's going to be cool. What trail are we doing today? The Moist. We're going to be running a Papa Smurf. And who are you? I'm Johnny. I'm going to be the trail lead. I'm this Jared. Is Jared. He's the full size Invasion mastermind. How many times have you done this trail? Today will be one of the times I'll do, I've done this trail. <laughs> Nobody's Nobody's done done this. Nobody's First done. time's a charm. That's right, that's right. Okay guys, this is uh, day five, I guess. I can't remember, four or five, something like that. <laughs> and we're having a great time. We're uh, heading off to uh, Papa Smurf and we're gonna try it out. The cool thing about this trail so far that we know of, no one in this group has done it, and no one really knows how it's gonna go. We've heard rumor that it can be kinda like the maze, which if that's true, this group right here is gonna have a hard time <laughs> if it's anything like the maze, because there's some stock trucks in here, uh, a couple of Jeeps, and so it's gonna be interesting. And another aspect that's going on today is it's sprinkling outside. Got a little rain going, so, this is going to get interesting. It's going to be slick on those obstacles, so uh, I see some RPMs pretty high in our future. So let's see what happens, guys. We'll see you here in a little bit. All righty, we're at Papa Smurf to number eight. Here we go. We got the Yoders with us. I got me a yoder.
leave it up to James to leave, just dig it out real nice for me. Where's he? You can take the I'm an idiot line. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking about that for like half a second. <laughs> Come to the dr passenger. Passenger, there you go. too far that way and then it slid you over in those holes yeah if you turn faster now there you go You go. 
Ryan. That's pretty rough. <laughs> with the Rice Krispies treats in there, man. <laughs> yeah! Heck yeah, thanks. that everybody else took but it was the line I took. It worked. Hey it worked for you right? Yep. Alright guys so uh, we're at the end of a full size invasion here in Sand Hollow. It's been awesome. I really enjoyed my time here. Uh, this place is so awesome to wheel. It's just hard to beat. Uh, the truck did amazing. I am like super happy. The torque converter I changed out made the changes on that. It just works like it's supposed to. We did some adjustments on the suspension, on the shocks while we were here. It really dialed it in, and I'm happy about that. So overall, great experience. Thanks to Full Size Invasion, Jared Jones. Really appreciate it. Got to wheel with some new people we never got to wheel with before. Uh, man, just had a great time. As always, good people. Got some new damage on the truck. Got a little bit of new stuff on this fender. It's going to need some love, you guys can see. And then uh, over on this side, yesterday where I got into it pretty good over here. I'm gonna have, probably have to end up doing a fender, so it just is what it is, guys. Overall, though, everything worked out good. I'm super happy with it. Uh, thanks to Ryan for coming along and taking care of uh, all the filming and the video, the photos. It's just awesome. I can't wait to go back whaling again. This is this is the Mecca, and I'm really excited to say we got to, to be here. I think we're coming back here in October to wheel again with full-size invasion, so can't wait.